the sun dappled. Oh. Ah, the air is so fresh. I never thought a walk in the woods could be so enjoyable. You can't do this in Iwatodai. <laughs> oh, so listen to this. Junpei was acting like such a pervert yesterday, and I didn't know how to react. It's probably a good thing we came out here by ourselves. Huh? Oh, yeah. Mitsuru received an incoming call on her phone. Mitsuru speaking. One moment, let me switch over to speakerphone. Please continue. Well, I'm at the lab here on the island, and a machine that was considered inoperable suddenly left the facility on its own. A machine? What kind of machine is it? I need detailed information to locate anything other than shadows. It's a combat vehicle, an anti-shadow weapon to be precise. A combat vehicle? You mean like a tank? We gotta let the others know. Where's my cell? We're not currently with the others, so it might take some time for us all to assemble. I see. Well, regardless, I want you to handle this as soon as possible. I'm on my way there now. If the target cannot be captured, do we have permission to destroy it? <laughs> I highly doubt you'll be able to destroy it. What? Then how are we supposed to stop it? Just do your best. I'll call you again later. Uh huh. Great. No one's answering. Don't worry about it. Let's go back and get our equipment. Then we can have Yamagishi's persona scan the area. Although this island is quite large. Jeez, oh, where could they be? <laughs> Guys arrived at the beach. The girls are nowhere to be found. Huh? Are the girls not up yet? Man, what lazy bones. The ocean's not gonna sit around and wait for us, you know? You're right. Once the sun sets, the water temperature drops, tiring you out much faster. Huh? Uh, I guess. Is that what you're worried about? That reminds me. One of the maids gave me a letter as we were leaving. Well, hey, Junpei! Junpei snatched away the letter Akiko was holding the, in the blink of an eye. Yeah, <laughs> no buts! I ain't letting any love letters from a lovely maid slip through my fingers. Oh, how dumb can you get? Ah, let's see here. This says we've gone to see the Joman cedar tree. Huh? It looks like Fuka's handwriting. Oh, man. We're at an island resort in the middle of summer. Why don't they go to the beach? That's just not right. Well, it is your fault. What do you mean? I, I just wanted to lighten up the mood. I don't want to hear it. Well doesn't matter anyway we're on our own now just the guys if you're out of ammo you pick it up on the battlefield that's one of the most basic military tactics we'll call this operation babe hunt babe hunt you mean like pick up girls what do you think akahiko san with you on the squad we're guaranteed to succeed akahiko is clearly hesitant about this <laughs> <laughs> Sounds like a hassle. Yeah, you're right. It does sound like a hassle. Well, then, what are we gonna do the rest of the day? Come on, guys. It'll be fun. Then I'm appointing him our leader as usual. Wait, hold on. No, 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 no. <laughs> bad decision. Bad, bad decision. No. Oh, dear. <clears throat> um. <laughs> Please get me out of this one. Somebody get me out of this one, because uh, <laughs> I haven't picked up girls in, since I was in high school. <clears throat> Anyways. What? Why? You said yourself this is an operation. Aw, oh, man, that's bullshit. You better take this seriously. It's an important operation. What? 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 Why? What is this music? Why is my head bobbing back and forth? Anyways, <clears throat> Beep, 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 dark confirmed. Let's move him for the kill. This is my Eric's piece, so listen up. First up, wait, I thought I was the leader. Okay, somebody's taking the reins. However, I'm pretty sure he's still gonna be stupid. I think, uh, think of something to talk about, something they might be interested in. Uh, give them an easy question to get the ball rolling. That's the golden rule. I'm like, uh, where are you from? Or having fun? 
Pretty soon you'll be tossing questions and, answer, uh, th questions and answers back and forth like you're playing catch. I'll start things off and you can ask the questions, all right? Here we go. Hey, ladies. Having fun? None of your business. Hey, no need to be shy. We, won't, we don't bite. Why should we tell you? Come on, cut us some slack. Just want to talk. You said you were an expert. Hold your horses. I'm just getting warmed up. Watch and learn. Oh, ladies, you in college? Um, don't tell me you guys are still in high school. Nope, not us. Seriously, you sure look like your high schoolers from here. Yeah, sorry, that's a lie. Oh, really? High school kids vacationing and yuckish humor? That kind of piss mm, that kind of pisses me off. Oh. Well, oh, we were invited to our friend's vacation home. Pretty cool, huh? Good for your friend. We, on the other hand, have to pay for our vacation with our hard-earned money. I guess we're just lucky. Yeah, lucky you. What do you want? Uh, what do you, uh, uh, what do you want anyway? Great choices. Nothing. And take a hike. Hey, Commander, look, there's a lady all alone. That means she's waiting for someone to hit on her, or we're guaranteed, or she's waiting for someone. Hey, cutie pies. That's not who I think it is, is it? No shit. No shit. <laughs> no. Oh my god. <laughs> that's that's Noriko Kashiwagi. <laughs> I thought so. I knew it was the teacher. That's the thirsty. That's the thirsty teacher. Um, <clears throat> I, I look at, I look over at Junpei and go abort, 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 abort. <laughs> Can I help you? Uh, hello. Excuse us. We're looking for a restroom. Hey, squirrel. He's pretty old up close. It doesn't matter. Hey, what are you whispering about? What? Oh, uh, you guys are in high school, aren't you? Y yes, you have a good eye. Can't help it, my job. Well, that's not important. You guys want to have some fun? Oh, uh, that's not right, is it? I mean, our ages. What? Akiyu's on. It's your turn. It was your turn anyway, and you're closer in a shirt. Oh, uh, well, <laughs> you have a nice body. You're thin, yet muscular. Hmm. I choose you. You want to go on a vacation to the world of romance with me? <laughs> uh, not real. Hey, you're gonna have to keep this a secret from everybody else. Hey, don't, don't touch me. Dangerous creeping up on Akiko. <laughs> Send, in... <laughs> Send in reinforcements or order a retreat. Send in reinforcements. Me? Uh, uh, um, uh, grandma. Her face is trembling. Run! That was close. <laughs> uh the woman. There's a woman all alone. I hope we don't have an experience like last time. Yeah, it's okay. What are the odds of it happening again? And I feel success in the air this time. Excuse me, miss. Hello, can I help you? Oh, she's hot. Uh, are you alone? Yeah, I'm so bored. And I've been spying on you. You've been trying to pick up girls for a while. Well, how'd you do? 
Mission failed. That's what I thought. You guys don't understand women at all. Uh, oops. You and that... You and the hat. You're way too wrapped up in yourself. You don't think about doing anything for the girl to make her feel special. Yes, ma'am. You and the t-shirt. You're the stoic type, but not very experienced around girls. You might be right. Or rather, you seem like someone who's too much of a hassle to be with, like you're super logical about everything. Well... And you, with the long hair, I'm not sure about you. Hey, don't hold back. <laughs> I mean, you're mysterious. You've got that whole and androgyny thing going on. Know what I mean? Yeah. Ah, you're smart. You're so smart. Hmm. I think you're my type. Hey, hey wait a second. Just joking. I like you a lot, too. Really? You want me to teach you how to make me feel special? Uh, yes, ma'am. Three versus one is too much. Can I pick one? I want someone fun and with a big heart. I get it, Juice! What the hell? Um... How about me? Hey, she means me, but... And for a while, guess what is it? It's just... There's something on your chin there. What? What? Did I miss a spot? Are, are you... There goes my chance. I was so close to snagging myself a little boy toy. This can't be happening. Maybe it was too early for you boys anyway. Eh, come see me when you're... Uh, when you're ready to have your horizons broadened. This sucks. We're 0 for 3. <sighs> What's wrong? I thought you weren't interested in picking up chicks. If I'm in a match, I want to win. <sighs> I know what our problem is. You can't control yourself. What? Don't blame this on me. I'm just stating the obvious. B but you haven't scored either. Why do you always got to be so logical, even in front of babes? It doesn't make any sense. What did you just say? Oh. Enough already. Leader, whose fault do you think it is? It's both your fault. I won't accept a stalemate. It's either him or me. Yeah, this is serious. Now tell us uh, who's... <gasps> What's the matter? You see something? Uh... Hello. Whoa, talk about saving the best for last. Now that's what I'm talking about. Man, she's cute. I agree. This is our last chance to make up for failures. But this time we should try one by one instead of all together. We'll have a better shot that way. Sounds like a good plan. All right, then let's decide the order. We'll go clockwise, starting with the winner. Ready? Rock, paper, scissors. Paper. You lost. No! I win. Okay, I'll go first. Akihiko-san will go second, and you'll go last. I'm up. Wish me luck. Hey, how's it going? I noticed you've been uh, staring at the ocean. So, um, do you come here often? My name's J J J Junpei. Ju Ju Junpei? Oh, don't worry, I. I just want to talk. I mean, I mean, it's more fun than standing here all by yourself, isn't it? I am looking for a human. Uh, oh, yeah? You are not the one. <laughs> <laughs> wow, he got shot down faster than I expected. Yeah, and, uh... Is this the machine that... Because it's already obvious she's not human. It, I'm guessing she's the machine. She's a tough one, senpai. Huh. Don't worry about me. Well, hello there. Say, uh, do you like the ocean? 
Is your question directed at me? Oh, um, yeah. I, I like the ocean, too. Hey, I heard that triathletes who train at the beach perform better than those who practice indoors. Makes sense, doesn't it? That type of information is irrelevant to me. <laughs> I won. I talked to her longer than you did. It doesn't matter how long you talk to her. <sighs> Ugh, this sucks. <laughs> <laughs> hey, stop crying. <laughs> I feel bad. So, that's our status. If you can't pull this off, I'm gonna be traumatized for the rest of my life. We're on the ropes, but it's not over yet. It's all up to you now. Oh no. I'll avenge you. What will you say to her? Tide is high. You are. I, I couldn't hear what he said, but she looks surprised. We should go over there. Initiating evasive maneuver. Confirmation must be made at a secure location. What? The girl ran into the forest. Hey, what did you say to make her run away like that? Well, what are you waiting for? Go after her. Yeah, I. Probably should. Don't tell her you're sorry. If you don't, we'll all be in trouble. Go on, man. You can catch her if you hurry. <clears throat> da -da 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 -da. You decide to chase after the girl into the forest. Great. Uh, the style of running seems strange. I don't know what you did, but you'd better talk to her. Dude, you better catch her and apologize. Make sure you bring her back here, too. Uh... Will do. Hold on. Let me look around just in case. Joy Monsugi. We lost. We lost sight of the girl. Feels as if someone is watching you. Oh, mysterious girl. You see the mysterious girl. You must be the one who has been watching you. Approach her. I was correct. I have found you. She threw her arms around. I you. have been searching for you. My highest priority is to be with you. Doesn't seem like she wants to let go. Um. What? I can't believe this. What's going on? He didn't even say anything to her. Ajupe and Nakiko have arrived. Even then, it doesn't seem like uh, she plans on letting go. There you guys are. What are you doing here? We've been looking all over for you. The girls have arrived as well. Um, what are you doing in the middle of the woods in your swimsuits? You have no idea what we've... Huh? Who's this? And why is she hugging you? Listen. We've encountered a problem. I'm sorry to interrupt your vacation, but I need you all to go back to the house and prepare for battle. That won't be necessary. We found what we were looking for. Maybe the Tsuki has arrived. Oh, oh, the gang's all here. You had me worried. You don't have permission to leave the lab on your own, I guess. I know. The girl answered while still hugging you. I guess. <clears throat> I apologize for all the trouble. Everything is under control now. So, what happened to capturing the tank? Oh, that's been taken care of. Come here, I guess. Coming. The girl you just met walked in. This is Igis. As you can see, she's a mechanical maiden. I am Igis. My mission is to destroy shadows. I have been assigned to seize. Effective immediately. No way. It's like she's alive. This is unbelievable. She's so cute, but she's a robot. Anti-shadow weapons were created 10 years ago to combat uncontrollable shadows. Igust was the last to be made, and she's the only one that still remains today. An anti-shadow weapon? Does that mean she... Yes. I am capable of operating the persona 
Palladian. She suffered major damage in combat and has remained in the lab ever since. It's still unclear as to why she suddenly reactivated herself this morning. Well, I hope you will all get along. An anti-shadow weapon with a will of her own? This is amazing! Um, by the way, when we first saw you, you were hugging him, right? Do you know him? Yes. It is very important for me to be by his side. Hmm. Perhaps her identification system is malfunctioning. Or maybe she's still half asleep. This is quite interesting. Hmm. I don't think it's that. Well, I can ponder this later. Oh, I forgot to tell you all. You can participate in a wide range of recreational activities here. Did main character's parents make her? That could, that, that could be it. That could be it. There's a tennis court, a pool table, even a karaoke machine. Would you care to hear me sing? <laughs> uh... No. Day three of your vacation on Yakushima. You came to the beach with everyone, including Agus. Or Igus. Man, it's already the third day of our trip. It's too bad we have to go home tomorrow. I'd totally stay longer if I could, but I can't complain. A lot of cool things happened while we were here. How can he be so full of energy? We were all up so late last night. Do we have a mission at the beach today? Nah, it's nothing like that. We just came here to have some fun. Do you understand what it means to have fun, I guess? Of course. Recreation is the refreshment of one's mind and body. Exactly. Well, you sure know a lot about us humans. All right, let's take one last dip before we leave. Junpei ran to the water's edge, dragging I guess along. Uh, hold on, Junpei-kun. Is it okay for I guess to go in the ocean? Oh, I'm sure she's waterproof. Only Igus returned. What's wrong, Igus? It is best that we all engage in this activity together. An activity in which only one person derives enjoyment is not the optimal method to have fun. Ugh, do we have to? <laughs> Despite her words early, Yukari is having fun in the water with Igus. We should join them. Okay. Fuka and Mitsuru also joined in. Kitsuki Are arrived. you enjoying yourself? We've been quite busy during our time here, but it looks as if we can relax a bit today. I hope so. Hey, Akihiko-san, come on! It's your turn! My turn? What are they doing? <laughs> I'm glad to see everyone is having so much fun. I've already told you what time the ship will be arriving tomorrow, yes? I'll most likely head over to the port early, so don't be late. Okay, I'll let everyone know. We can get back down to business again once we're back at the door. Got it. Ah, neat. They had him, like, hey, fading off in the distance. This again? I guess we should go too. I guess, wait! That's not what water gun means! <laughs> Junpei Kun is down! <laughs> All right, here's our chance for an all-out attack. Attack! Whoa, 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 time out! I seriously can't take much more of this. <laughs> you had a fun time with your friends at Yakushima. With Igus joining, things are likely to get livelier. Nice. Party members can now take a mortal blow for you in battle? When you receive a blow that would otherwise kill you, your ally will take the hit for you during battle. Uh oh, neat. When punks of the hangout are whooping it up as usual. He was sitting by himself, away from the group. Uh, uh, uh. 
Three dark figures approach Shinjiro. You seem to be in great pain. You guys. Ah, shit, it's them. You mean those three? Wow, they're freaky. Shut up, let's go. Bunks left the hangout. Why do they always run and hide when I approach? They're like back alley rats. Beats me. Jin, give him the capsules. <laughs> A smart looking guy handed Shinjiro something. Thanks. I'll pay you the same as. Hold up. This time, information will suffice. Your acquaintances have been busy lately. I'm referring to their activities on nights when the moon is full. They spend a great deal of time in the tower as well. Why did they take this burden upon themselves? <laughs> you do know, don't you? But you don't wish to say. Is it because they are your friends? No, I've got nothing to do with them. Then tell us. Wouldn't you agree these pills are more important than a bunch of strangers? <laughs> I don't know the details, but... Supposedly, if you destroy all those creatures, then the tower will disappear, and with it, the Dark Hour. You mean, they intend to eliminate the Dark Hour? Why would they do such a thing? With the power they have... What? They wish to destroy the Tower of Demise as well? Tower of Demise? Who wouldn't want to take out that damn tower? Easy, Takaya. Yes. Yes. Three left. <laughs> I can't go back. Not after what happened. And I'm beat. Oh, we're back. <clears throat> it seemed to take forever to get back. Yeah, it was a tiring trip. Please rest up so you're ready for the next operation. Any plans for summer break so I can fight shadows all you want? Well, you must be really bored. Shut up, Yucatan. Uh, whatever. We just have to defeat those last six and it'll all be over. The lost will get better and everything will be back to normal, right? That's why we have to try our hardest. <clears throat> These are your lodging quarters? Very well, I shall be by your side at all times. She is still far from passing as human. It seems she is unable to understand ordinary feelings and conversations at the moment. If she were to able to do that, you might be able to create a bond with her. What? Repeat that again. From this, she's unable to understand ordinary, ordinary feelings and conversations at the moment. If you're able to do that, you might be able to create a bond with her. How about ages? How come she knows me? I do not know. Perhaps it's simply a glitch in her human recognition programming. Regardless, that has nothing to do with yourself. What are the others? I assume you're referring to the other anti-shadow weapons. Well, there were many created. You could say they were Aegis' sisters. However, they were all destroyed ten years ago in the incident. Aegis, I guess, has been quite lonely since then. Why is she in human form? Her personas are created from human minds, so the plan was to place a, sh a human mind inside an anti-shadow weapon. The only real issue was the form uh, the weapon would take. If the form of the weapon was a tank, for instance, the weapon's mind would recognize itself as a tank. However, a tank is not a living entity. This is crucial, you see, because the mind of a non-living entity will not process human thoughts correctly. And so will not function properly and will soon become corrupted. However, a mind placed inside of... of form that closely resembles human body will recognize itself as a human being, thus allowing it to easily adapt to human thoughts. Therefore, Igis and her sisters were built in the form of human beings. Interesting. Interesting. Do you think anyone will be able to tell that she's a robot? I don't. I mean, you'd really have to be looking for a robot to figure that out. As long as she acts normal, no one will suspect a thing. She's cute, huh? Super cute. I don't think I've ever met a machine that was so cute before. 
Hmm, an anti-shadow weapon. That will be most welcome addition. Most souvenirs are worthless. Snow globes, keychains, postcards. Hey, they're sentimental. They're nice. Well... I guess, sort of useless, but they're also, they're sentimental, which means they hold feelings of someone's, you know, whatever. <coughs> However, this is one souvenir from Yoki. I wish that it's mm, Chespian. A lot of people are joining the team now. It's so much fun and so much different than before. I mean, also, everyone seems to be tired. Maybe we should skip going to TARDIS tonight and just rest. E I would happen to agree. Oh, I feel good. I feel great. <sighs> well, maybe not in real life right now because my neck is actually starting to kill me. It's starting to hurt. I might have twisted a little too much today or... Feel normal. Hey, Yukari, Mitsuru, Vacant, Puka. Uh, what happened to the kid? What happened to the kid? Okay, so we might be getting two more female. Well, maybe one of them is actually, uh, I guess is, and it just hasn't updated yet. So this one of these is probably, I guess, his room. Uh, we still got two more rooms. One of these is probably the little kid, and the other one is maybe the the back alley dude. Maybe. Yeah, we'll see. Hold on, my leg is starting to itch. However, <clears throat> unfortunately, I gotta call this stream. <laughs> 